Hey what's up guys, it's Levi here and welcome to a brand new video on the Team Guller channel where in this video I will give you the best players per position. So the budgets we're gonna discuss are about players for 10k coins, players worth 100k coins and players worth around 250k coins. So there should be a player for every one of you watching right now that you could put into your team. We are gonna start off with the goalkeepers, where for me, a goalkeeper was good for like 10k coins, you should go for Pope. I think he only costs around 2k, not expensive at all, he just does the job for you. Then, if you have a bit more budget, I think the one you should look for is Courtois. Although for goalkeepers, it's a bit different. As I said, I wanted to name players for 10k, 100k and 250k coins. For goalkeepers, it's different because you have goalkeepers for 10k or less and 100k less, but the gap between that 100k and 250k coins isn't there. Then you really need to go for like 800, 900k coins, where I think Buffon is the best keeper in the game for me. Obviously, goalkeeper is all about personal preference, but I understand you don't want to spend so many coins on the goalkeeper. So if you have a lot of coins, just go for Courtois. If you don't have a lot of coins, you should go for Pope. Then the center backs, 10k coins. I think you guys can guess who I have for 10k coins. Mickey van der Ven, of course. High pace, good defending stats, good physical abilities. Has everything you are looking for in the center back. Then, 100k coins, we have Saliba. Saliba is insane. Anticipate plus, every time he tackles the ball, he wins it. Then, the last center back, I'm going to recommend you guys, Big Verge. Obviously, defending wise, great, but that's not even the thing that makes him special. He's a threat going forward. If you have a corner, cross it to Van Dijk, he will head it in every single time, and it's just unstoppable. So, these three are the best center backs for every budget. Let's jump over to our right backs, where for 10k coins, I have Marcos Llorente. For 100k coins, I also have Marcos Llorente. There is a really big gap from Llorente to a higher level, where for me a higher level right back is going to be Jogo Dalo, but he already costs around 250k coins. So for 10k or 100k, I would stay with the same right back, which is called Marco Llorente. Then for the left back, 10k coins, I would go for Rolfe. She is so good in everything. Her, her pace maybe isn't too great, but I don't really feel any problems with that. Then for 100k coins, I would go for Ferlan Mandi. Then again, the gap between Ferlo Mendy and Tio Hernandez, who is the best left back in the game for sure. He does cost more than 250k coins, but if you can afford him, you will never regret because he is just insane, guys. Then for the center mids, around 10k coins, I would go for Bruno Fernandes. Long ball plus pass is so good this year, just because of one play style. Apart from that, Brim, his card maybe doesn't look too special, but even pros are using him just because of this playstyle. So if you don't have a lot of coins, go for Bruno, because I think he's 12 to 13k coins. Everybody should be able to afford him, and he is a top tier card, guys. Then, for around 100k, we're going for Stanway. Pink Pass Plus, almost gullet gang. She's just insane. She isn't too tall, but that makes her very good to dribbling. Defending-wise, she isn't lacking either, so she's just a really solid midfielder. Then the next center mid, maybe my favorite player, Federico Valverde. He costs slightly more than 250k coins, but he is definitely worth it. His power shots, guys, are out of this world. You will score so many goals with him. I think He's maybe the center mid I used that scored the most for me since I ever used center mids. Every time I perform a power shot, it is a chance or I get a corner. That's when Van Dijk gets introduced again. So it's just a really good combination. Having the power shot, having an aerial at the back. If you get a corner, it's a good chance. And if it's not a corner, most of the times it will be a goal with this power shot play style. Then left mid, Nico Williams for 10k coins. 100k coins, I would go for in from Kvaratskhelia and around 250k coins. The man was always smiling, Rafael Leao. Why Nico Williams? His dribbling is insane. He has the rapid playstyle plus, so his speed boosts are good. His finishing is actually solid. Also his passing, I think this card is a real bargain for around 10k coins for sure. At the start of the year, when the speed boost didn't get patched, he was like 150k. Now I feel like the speed boost is still very good. So I don't know why he's that cheap. If you don't have a lot of coins, make sure to go for Nico Williams. 
Kvaratskelia, five star, five star. I don't need to talk too much about that. Left foot, good passing, skill moves. He has everything you're looking for in a left winger. Then Rafael Leao, pace, trickster fake shot, good shooting, good dribbling. He is just almost the perfect winger. So also like 300k coins, a bit more than 250k. If you have the coins, go for him. But also Nico Williams is a really, really good option, guys. Then in right mid for 10k coins, we have Lauren James. Five star skills. Four star weak foot, I think she's really underrated. Her skill moves are nice, but her physical abilities, guys, everybody's sleeping on those because she just bullies everyone. I don't know how it comes, how it happened, but I really, really like this card. I don't know why. She costs around 9k coins, and I think she is so much better than her price says. Then for 100k coins, I think he only cost around 20k. Usman Dembele, again, five star, five star, good pace. We all know Dembele. He is just good in game. Then Mohamed Salah, of course, finesse plus. He has good dribbling, good passing, good shooting. Pace isn't there in the 95s. Salah, we all know what we get from him. He is definitely worth your coins. And then the last position, maybe the one you've waited for, the striker. 10k coins go with Luis Openda. 100k coins, she costs around 50k. Smith. She is insane. She's a nightmare to face, even for me in Weekend League. She's so annoying to play against. She's so quick, good finishing, five-star weak foot. I don't know why this card only costs 50k coins. Then last but not least, for around 250k coins, I think it costs less, Hun Min Son. Smith and Son up top is a nightmare to face, guys. If you can't afford like the Fini, Leao, Mbappe, these two are the ones you want to be rocking with up front because even me, while I play with Mbappe, Cruyff, etc. now, I still hate to face these two because they seem to score every shot and you just can't get the ball of them. So that's basically it for this video, guys. I've showed you lots of players for every position, every budget. So make sure to like this video. Make sure to comment down below. If you haven't subscribed on our channel yet, make sure to do that. All that I want to say is thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Ciao.